let's look at this question on the bank translation statement. <coughs> question says, see the maker maintains a business bank account with Second Bank Nigeria Limited. Bank statement received for the month. Bank statement received for the month of March 1999. Show the balance of what? 14,265 to his credit. While according to his cash book, he should be having 13,380. That shows what the discrepancy between the bank statement and the cash book. Subsequent investigation revealed the following. So they tried to look into what caused the discrepancy between the bank statement and the cash book. So these are the what the findings. So what we're gonna do now, we are, we are asked to find what to capture to prepare the adjusted cash book and the bank translation statement. Why do you have to adjust the cash book? You have to adjust the cash book to show the through balance of the cash book afterward adjusting the discrepancy that occurs in the cash book but not in the bank statement. So first thing is what C a maker C a maker. Then, then we have to prepare a the adjusted adjusted cash book. Adjusted cash book. We have it. Now, say the balance in the cash book. Is what 13,380. 13,380. So balance went forward is what 13,380. So bank column of the cash book has 13,380 as its balance. So looking through the investigation, we said A, two checks for what 3,400 and 6,000 deposited to the bank on 28th of what March 1999 were not credited. Not credited. So we have to hold out those words. Not credited. Means there was uncredited checks. Not credited by the bank until what 2nd of April 1999. We have that uncredited checks. So these checks have been what entered in our cash book already. So we don't have any issue with our cash book as regards to those two checks. So we have to what adjust that in the what bank information statement. So we move to the next one. B. A check for 3000 received from a customer in full settlement of a debt, full settlement of a debt. The debt is what? The total debt is what? 3,300. And the entire in the cash book at the what? Full value of debt. Now, what happened here? A check for 3,000 naira. So, the customer, the customer has paid 3,000 naira in full settlement of his debt of what? 3,300. Meaning that, See, a maker has given the customer 300 naira worth discount. As 300 naira worth discount, cash discount. So, instead of recording what 3000 naira, the cash that was received, 3000 naira check, check, pardon me, check that was received, 3000 naira, instead of recording 3000 naira received, see, a maker recorded what 3300 naira. So, but in the cash book, we only record what transactions that are what that are based on what cash or check. So from here, you make a record three thousand three hundred instead of what three thousand. So what are we going to do? What happened here is that 
okay? The, uh, the debit balance of the bank column has been what, overcasted with 300 Naira. So we are going to what, adjust it. So we are going to remove the 300 Naira that what, was overcasted. So we remove it from here, we de we, so we therefore credit it. Credit 300 Naira, receipt overcast. Receipt overcast. 300 Naira. So this 300 Naira will have the effect of reducing the 3,300 that was recorded or debited by TA Maker in error. So the 300 Naira will reduce it, so we have what 3,000 as, as, the, as the balance that was recorded. That is that. Then we move towards C. A check for 6,500 issued to Django Limited had not been what presented for payment. So had not been presented, making this one what unpresented check. Unpresented check had not been presented. We have issued out the check to what the customer to our, to our supplier to what to cash it from our bank. But that check has not been presented as at what sending of our what bank statement. But we have already credited our account that the amount has gone out of our account, but the bank has not debited our account. So that will make our what, cash book, the credit balance of our cash book to what overcast it. So what do we do? We have to remove that amount, but we are not going to remove it from the cash book because we have already recorded it. Our cash book is fine. So we go into the word bank statement and remove it. So we leave that and move on to the next. Number D, dividend of what 650 from PZ Limited and the word paid directly to the world to the bank. So this one is dividend or you could call it what credit transfer. So dividend paid directly to the bank without our awareness. So TA Baker was not aware that they paid the dividend. So he could not what, enter it into his what, cash book. So that was why that dividend amount caused what, a difference or a discrepancy between the cash book and what the bank states with. So what we have to do now is what put the word the order entry. So the order entry now, since dividend is received, so we are what debiting the cash book since we are receiving it. So we come here, dividend. How much? Six fifty. Then E, the bank deducted a total of what one hundred twenty-five as its charges. The bank we were not told when they were deducting it. Because at the beginning of the month, we, we, can't, we can't assume the amount we pay as charges at the end of the month. So we have to wait till the end of the month for the bank to determine that and charge us I mean, to the tune of that amount. So what happens now is that we are not aware of the amount they charge us, but when, after receiving our bank statement, that was when we were, we were able to work, see that what we have been charged for what for the activities the bank carried out on our behalf, that's our bank charges. So now, since it is not in the cash book, now we have to include it. It is already in our bank statements. So we include it. How much? How much was it? One hundred twenty-five naira. Since it's a, it's a debit to our bank statement, it will be a credit to our what cash book bank statement. I mean bank charges. Bank charges. How much? One hundred twenty-five naira. Then F, the bank had credited a check of what? 3,560. The bank credited a check of 3,560 of the Anaka in error to see a account. Now we are lucky enough, the bank credited our account, our bank, our bank account with what? T Amaka's check in error. The amount was over 3,560. We are only able to see it after we have received our bank statement. So the amount 3,560 was created into our account. So this will make our bank statement to be in excess of our what cash book. So that's we need to a discrepancy. So what do we do to this one now? We have to what make the same error the bank has made because we cannot correct the error for them. We cannot correct the bank's error. What we just have to do is what completes the other leg of the transaction. They have created our account. Normally, we are meant to 
debit our cash book, but we will not do that in the cash book because we have not received the cash. So what we have to do is to what increase our balance as per cash book in our bank state in our bank reconciliation statement. So why do we increase it? Because our what the amount we have in our bank balance, I mean our bank statement has increased by what this amount which was credited to us in error. So we will also what increase our cash book. To what to show the what to this the second leg of the transaction, we will not say because uh, the bank has credited us three thousand five sixty, then we are going to remove it. No, we will have to complete the what transaction the bank has already begun. We cannot what correct our what error for them. So what we have to do now that goes into our what bank consolidation statement. So we have to close this book now. Close the adjusted cash book. So here we then have the total here now is 0, 13, 3, 1, 0, 1, 14. We have 14, 0, 3, 0. So we are removing it to get our balance. So we have 14, 0, 3, 0 minus 425, 425. Equals to 13,605. So these are our balance carried down. So from there, we prepare our bank reconciliation statement and our bank reconciliation statement. For TMECA Bank Reconciliation Bank Reconciliation Statement. Bank Reconciliation Statement for the months. See as at thirty fourth of March nineteen ninety nine. So here we can start either with our balance as per cash book or balance as per bank statement. If you start with one, we arrive at the other. If you start with the other, we arrive at the one. So what do we have to do here? We are starting with balance as per cash book, adjusted balance. So I'm taking this value now. Adjusted balance as per cash book. Adjusted balance as per cash book. And this value is 13,605. Now I want to adjust all the words, other entries, uncredited check. So first, we want to add on presented check. We add it back. Balance as per cash book. We adding it back. On presented check. Add on presented check. On presented check. On presented check was six thousand five hundred. Six thousand five hundred. Then remember our bank error. Now they made this error of 3,500 CD erroneously credited our account. So we are going to increase our bank statement, our cash book as well, with the same amount. So we are coming here, bank error. We perform the same error. We complete the, what, the second level of the transaction. Bank error. How much? 3,560. So we are adding this. This then gives us 10,060. 10,060. So, the total here is 5, 6, 6, and we have 3, 4. Right? We have 3, 2. 23,065. Then you come and say less uncredited uncredited checks uncredited checks uncredited checks are what? two uncredited checks 3,400 and that's about 6,000 less uncredited checks so we have 3,000 3,400 plus 6,000 3,400 plus 6,000 so the total is 9,400 9,400. So we remove this, what do we get? 
Thank you. 